obviously I don't see that as an appropriate comment. I think, look, what we're trying to do around here is improve the tone and the civility of the debate. Uh, and this obviously doesn't help do that. Um, but I do think that they're going to persevere through this because we have a promise to keep. And the promise we made is we would repeal and replace this health care law. Uh, this afternoon, the House will take action on two initiatives to keep Americans safe. The first is Kate's Law. As you know, this is named after Kate Steinle, who was murdered two years ago in San Francisco by an illegal immigrant who had been deported several times. He should not have been here, and she should not have died. So this initiative, this initiative will toughen penalties for illegal immigrants who repeatedly re-enter the country. The second measure gives the government the authority to withhold grants from cities that fail to cooperate with federal law enforcement. By flagrantly disregarding the rule of law, sanctuary cities are putting lives at risk, and we cannot tolerate that. It is beyond my comprehension why federal, state, and local officials sworn to enforce the laws of the nation as I am would actively discourage or outright prevent law enforcement agencies from upholding the laws of the United States, and why they would set public funds aside to pay for the legal representation of illegal aliens who are also lawbreakers. In doing so, they prioritize criminals over public and law enforcement officer safety.